Any military or police group that carries out operations inside buildings or other confined spaces will always be equipped with the most suitable firearms for such tasks, capable of quickly reducing a threat through the perfect combination of strength, fire volume, and ease of use. Even though almost every pistol, submachine gun, gunshot, or carabine could be used for this, some of them have more advantages than others. Hello everyone and welcome back to US Marines Force. In this video, we'll classify the best 10 firearms for close combat according to their size and weight, which is connected to the gun's agility of use, power of the magazine, and shooting. Number 10 Submachine Gun, Chris Vector. Its strength comes with its extremely powerful cartridge, 40 Smith Wesson and 45 ACP. This compact firearm also has an extremely high cadence shooting that doesn't generate a kickback difficult to control as you would imagine thanks to the system Chris Super V that deviates the kickback towards the lower part of the gun. It was designed in the United States and became active in 2009 which makes it one of the most modern guns in this video. In its most powerful version, the Chris Vector uses caliber 40 Smith & Weston in 30 cartridge magazines. It has a cadence shooting of 1200 rounds per minute, it's 62 centimeters long and 6 centimeters wide, and it weighs just 2.7 kilograms. Number 9 Submachine Gun Ingram MAC-10 Considered to be a personal defense firearm, or PDW, and not a submachine gun of full size, the MAC-10 is even smaller and easier to use than the Chris Vector. This weapon can be equipped with a large silencer that turns into a stealthy submachine gun, although it increases the weapon size by 28 centimeters. It has a relatively difficult to control kickback. Thanks to its powerful magazine, the MAC-10 is devastating when used in combined spaces. This American machine gun uses a caliber 45 ACP in 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 1,090 rounds per minute, it's 54.8 centimeters long and 5 centimeters wide, and it weighs 2.8 kilograms. Number 8, Submachine Gun PP90. Originally from Russia and active since the 90s by the Spetsnaz Special Forces, the PP90 is a foldable weapon that could be carried as a compact rectangular cover of polymer and metal and be quickly uncovered and used when needed very similar to the famous American prototype Magpul FMG9. However, the PP90 is completely operative, and its size, even when unfolded, is the smallest in this video. This submachine gun uses a caliber 9x18mm Makarov in 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 700 rounds per minute, it's 49 centimeters long and 3.2 centimeters wide, and it weighs 1.8 kilograms. Number 7, HK MP5-10 is the best of the submachine guns in this video when it comes to power thanks to its extremely powerful cartridge, 10 millimeter auto. This version of the famous MP5 from Heckler & Co became active in 1992 and was discontinued in 2000. However, this didn't stop it from becoming the strongest weapon of its kind nowadays. Leaving some trusting issues aside, the MP510 is just as precise, light, and easy to use as its counterpart of the caliber 9x19mm Parabellum. It uses a caliber 10mm auto in 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 800 rounds per minute, it's 68 centimeters long, 6.7 centimeters wide, and it weighs 2.5 kilograms. Number 6, Carabine Knight's Armament Company PDW has the ideal combination of the power of a rifle cartridge with the cadence shooting and the small size of a machine gun. The KAC PDW is an experimental firearm for governmental agencies and private security. The Secret Service of the United States officially uses them. Having more strength than any submachine gun in this video, this gun from Knight's Armament Company was designed in 2006 and uses the experimental caliber for short barrels, 6 by 35 millimeters from 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 900 rounds per minute, it's 71 centimeters long and 6.8 centimeters wide, and it weighs just 2 kilograms. 
Number five, Carabine LWRC M6 PSD. This firearm combines the lightness and ease of use of a submachine gun with the strength of a rifle cartridge. It was designed especially for bodyguards and safety teams operating in confined spaces. This is a short barrel carabine based on the platform AR-15, but using a short stroke gas piston, very similar to the one of the rifle HK-416. The LWRC M6 PSD uses a caliber 6.8 by 43 millimeter Remington SPC from 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 900 rounds per minute. It's 63.5 centimeters long and 6.8 wide, and it weighs 2.67 kilograms. Number four, Fostec Origin 12 is the only shotgun caliber 12 you'll see in this video. This shotgun has a similar small size to the Remington TAC-14 or the Mossberg Shockwave, but unlike them, it has a butt that provides support and the ability to mitigate the kickback, similar to any full-length profile shotgun, but with only a fraction of their size and weight. This gun is also smaller than a bullpup shotgun, as Tabor TS-12, and it can be equipped with a noise suppressor and drum magazines. It uses caliber 12 from 10 cartridge magazines in an automatic system. It's 89 centimeters long and 13.5 centimeters wide, and its weight is 4.2 kilograms. Number three, submachine gun HK MP7. Developed during the 1990s as a response to the OTAN request to replace the caliber 9x19mm Parabellum and create a set of pistols and submachine guns with penetrating calibers. The MP7 couldn't be standardized in the nations of the organization, but it's currently used by multiple military and police forces. Its main strength are its body armor penetrating cartridge its low weight, and its high cadence shooting. It uses caliber 4.6 by 30 millimeters from 40 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 950 rounds per minute. It's 63.8 centimeters long and 5.1 centimeters wide, and its weight is just 2.1 kilograms. Number two, submachine gun SR2 Varesk. Developed in Russia in 1991, together with the gun SR-1 Vector, to standardize a set of weapons for close combat with penetrating cartridges. The SR-2 is the lightest firearm you'll see in this video. This together with its high cadence shooting and hybrid cartridge that expands when hitting soft targets or keeps its pointy shape when hitting body armor, makes it one of the deadliest weapons for confined spaces. This gun uses cartridge 9x21mm Gerza from 30 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 950 rounds per minute. It's 60.3 centimeters long and 5.1 centimeters wide, and it weighs 1.65 kilograms. Number one, submachine gun FN P90. This gun has an efficiency 27% higher than the HK MP7 in penetrating targets with and without armor. According to an OTAN assessment committee, the P90 is a submachine gun developed at the beginning of 1990 with the pistol FN 5.7, which armor, penetrating cartridge, and automatic version are only available for sale to military and police institutions. Having a very compact size, high ammunition capacity, ergonomic bullpop profile, ambidextrous controls, and high cadence shooting, this submachine gun is undoubtedly the most efficient gun to use in confined spaces. The P90 uses a cartridge 5.7 by 28 millimeters from 50 cartridge magazines. Its cadence shooting is 950 rounds per minute. It's 50.5 centimeters long and 5.5 centimeters wide, and it weighs 2.63 kilograms. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much and see you next time.